Hey guys, I'll be here bringing you back, hopefully what I'm assuming is going to be the very last episode of um, the last day of June. So this is the last day of the last day of June, uh, most likely. So far, uh, we're still uh, at the crumbling, uh, but we will be fixing that in just a bit here as we dive in to this eccentric man. And just solve it one more time. The old man still hasn't been used yet though, so either we're almost done or we're only still 75% uh, of the way done. Alright. Get this guy going. <coughs> so the task of this one is we're just simply shooting away the problem. So we do that and we get all the way to this point. And this is where we diverged uh, last time so we weren't sure where we were supposed to, uh, what we were supposed to do. Um, we just followed the path and we fell into a haystack. So I'm glad it just brought me here instead of making me do everything all over again. Um, how many more does he need? I think it's just one more as well. Beautiful. And then we'll look at his memories of why he's this bearded eccentric man. What caused him to care so deeply about his father? Well, it's his father or his grandfather's uh, pendant, so I understand why he cares about it. It makes sense. It's just, uh, why is he allowed to shoot guns in open spaces like this, you know? And nobody seems to care. So before we grab this last little bit, under the shadow of my father. It was his father. Look at that. Let's take a look. Let's learn a little bit more of the gunman. Oh, he grew up friends with uh, the main protagonist. Uh, they played together, but he was meant to go train. Oh wow, he was. This is this is that moment where you realize it's like you know what he is who he is because of how he was raised, and sometimes you know uh, a tough father figure casts a pretty big shadow. He didn't actually want to be shooting or learning those things. But he did it. And then sadly, his father passed. So that's why it means so much to him. And it would mean, even if he wasn't, like, raised that way, it, an heirloom from the family, from from a loved one, uh, would mean the world to you. Understood, man. <laughs> Alright. What could cause you to lose your wife this time? Let's find out. This is the most important scene. We've done everything we could have possibly done. How does this old man kill my wife? Can we get past that cliff? Someone's gonna have to watch that cliff though. It's gonna break at one point and kill somebody, so. Just saying. Someone should knock it down earlier than later. Oh my god, we're still in a wheelchair. I don't know what kind of hocus pocus we're doing. 
I don't really think there is a way to bring back your loved one. Not like this, but... We'll find out anyways. Why won't this work? Because you can't change the past. The past can only change you. <laughs> Alright. This looks like it's like the last trial. Avoided. 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 Dude, instead of doing that, you should slow down. It can't be avoided. A lightning strike? No matter what, it was gonna happen. It was her time. How do you stop a lightning strike, buddy? Personally, I'd just be thinking, what's the point? That's how I'd feel. It's like, you see that moment, what is the point? Look at all the effort we struggled to do things. I feel defeated too. Why, why go forward, buddy? Let's go. This is really sad. <laughs> I knew he was gonna be the last one, but there's nothing even leading here. Wait a minute. Alright, alright. I'm thinking here that this is a lose lose situation now. The only way to save her is to kill him and I don't know who if he's his father which it looks like he is or her my wife's father and this is this is huge it's like do you really send whether it's your father or her father do you send a, another loved one to take the place of a loved one I know sometimes people will think, like, uh, just because you're older, I don't even know if this is going to pan out that way, but that's what it feels like. It, it feels like it's going to be a trade. And, to be honest, one life does not matter more than another life in any situation, so... I hope it's not a trade. Yeah, I, I, I get it. He sees it. it's pointless. I'm gonna be really, really, really sad if it's it's if it's a trade. I know how there's always that saying that parents are willing to take. Uh, want to die before their children and that, that's true in the sense of like 
you wouldn't want to see your child die before you, but still, I do not want to see a trade. Question mark? Did it always have a question mark? I feel like it just said save her as that's what you have to do. How? Don't even know what that was. My God. Are you saying this is all because of the present? If I don't give her the present, it never happens. sworn he would have gotten it for sure yeah, he would be the one that unlocks his own door oh my god he can run I forgot <laughs> oh jeez. I know where one is. <laughs> I 
those who are gone. Wait a minute, was there a way to get into that door? I just didn't do it? There was never a way to get in there. Unless when I was coming by. So it wants me to do a different route. But how do I get that door open? Wait a minute, how do I get that last one? It's right there. Give me that last one! I want it so bad! Okay, hold on. Let's just check. Yeah, I'm supposed to be able to get it. I'm supposed to be able to get it. I don't think that one would be missing. If it was the last one, then I would understand that maybe there was something else I was supposed to do, but... can to keep me from going that way. Oh. 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 
me to go to the grave. I still find it odd that I, I didn't get that last one. I'm, I'm wondering if I did something wrong somewhere. Well, either way. That is father. wants me to go. Hey, not there. curiosity is how do I get that one thing still I'm still baffled Oh my god, wait a minute, wait a minute! Did I have a way to it? I have a back door. Ha ha! Ha ha! Alright, guys. They say we die twice. What? Alright, let's find out his memories before we continue going further. So clearly I'm starting to think that this is his mom and dad of the main protagonist. So, I feel like it's coming down to a trade.
Alright, now that's open. I didn't get to scope out the house. Ooh, a treasure box. Alright, so as far as I can tell, it seems like I'm still capable of going to the house and deliver it. I don't see anything else I can do. I just don't see anything else I can do. Oh my god, man. The crying is intense. What else am I supposed to do? There's only one option. Give it, give him the gift. Oh my god, it's just so much yelling and screaming. Whoa. That's too down. I feel like I'm destroying the world, but, you know, is she really, it's just like she's not meant to be alive. I have to give this gift. I am death, and I am bringing death to his door. I'm so sorry. I am killing your wife. My dear son, I am killing your wife. I have no choice. Some things cannot be changed.
couldn't bring her back, no matter how hard I tried. I couldn't bring her back. It is obvious, you can't change things like that. And it's hard to cope. What's, what's kind of great about this, and sad at the same time, you don't know when death is going to come knocking. It just looks like a, a typical day for you. And... You don't say. Oh, we get another try? I have to make it so that way she doesn't choose to go there? Oh my god, I've never had so many, uh, someone have so many chances of life here. change one thing. change two things. It's always coming down to that gift. It's no matter what I do, it's always coming down to the gift. Here we go again. Let's try it again. Ah, jeez.
same thing again. How do I get rid of the gift? I don't know, I feel like it's the, the kid has to stop him. Kid doesn't do anything. The gift just keeps coming. Oh, she gets there sooner. Keep it quiet, he keeps sleeping. And they spend all the time chatting. He wakes him up. She never went upstairs. Done. <clears throat> Did we do it? Is that it? My God. <laughs> you could not stop this. <coughs> Clearly. You couldn't stop the gift. In the end, we chose to go. <laughs> My God. No matter what you do. If the Elric brothers taught me anything. Equivalent exchange. You can't give something up without losing something of equal or more value. Well, of equal value, but it always turns out it's for life, it's more. Chairman. For someone with a lot of scrawny bones and for arms, he's pretty strong to lift himself up. I don't even know what to say, man. I feel so bad. We tried so hard. Tried so hard. All for nothing. Forget? No. Or maybe. Maybe we have to. Or maybe we have to. Yeah. <laughs>
Yeah. Oh my god, I don't know who to do next. I don't know who to do next, because you know what, to be honest. I I don't know who to blame the most here. I, I feel like I, I want to blame my, my dad. Uh, I want to blame the kid. Ah, uh, you, you! You and your... Your ways. <laughs> uh, you and your silly gun! You... Why couldn't you get rope? <laughs> you... You gave her the gift that started it all. You... <laughs> Alright. Aggression out. <coughs> Man, what a rush. What? I can I can go upstairs. Well, I, I was wondering how he would go to bed. Oh my God! No. Did I still have my kid? Oh my god, I am... I won't lie, I'm shaking a little. <laughs> and tears are a little welling up in my eyes here. Oh. Oh. oh, there's no baby, okay. Not okay, but... If I still had my kid... Ooh, she's behind you. That's not creepy at all. <laughs> she's not there. Alright, right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, this place is cobwebs and it's empty. Where's the teddy go? Explorer mode, no matter what, no matter what game you're playing, you always gotta explore. My wife's name is June. <coughs> what? What? What?
Wait. Wait. If we go. Wait. If we go. <coughs> if we go. It's over. We can't go. We can't go. Oh my god, if we go, it's over. We gotta wonder, this place is off the beaded path. Why can't I go here? This place is off the beaded path. I guess I don't have the speed function in the start. How many chances have I gotten so far to save this life? We're gonna keep going, we're gonna go overtime on this one, because I feel like we're right at the end. Unmanly right now. We may look like we're a slave driver. I ain't telling her. Nope. Nope. I'm accepting it. I'm the one to die. If I tell her, does it stop? <coughs> no. I'm not telling it. I took it. I took it to the grave. You guys have told her. It just seems like she she did her best to save me. Wait a minute. If I don't tell her, would she just still do the same thing? Would it be an endless loop? Where she dies for me, I die for her, she dies for me.
don't even know what the present is, man. This whole time. This whole time. Still has the baby. One life for two. May not be equivalent exchange, but sometimes you get past that gate. <laughs> Sometimes just get lucky. I swear if that bird took my glasses, I'd be pissed. I wonder if I told her if we would have survived together. But I feel like if I told her, she would probably be willing to die for me again. <laughs> Alright. Well, I teared up a bit. <laughs> it was quite, a, quite an emotional run. It was good. I like it. See, this is what I like. You just story takes you and you kind of just give up your yourself to the writer and you just let them pour into you the emotions that they want you to feel you gotta go in with an open mind though can't be too distracted I guess they stayed friends and I guess she moved on We didn't see her move. We didn't see her pass by us. So clearly she stayed. After what happened. And because she doesn't have her longing for me, she has no reason to feel awkward around her. Such a good. This is definitely worth it, guys. I know this one's long. Uh, but the finale definitely, definitely, definitely worth it. Carl. Carl is my name. Jude. The kid. The best friend. The hunter. The old man. Yes, my name is Carl. Carl. Ooh. One more time. And we unlocked everything on the way. Like. It was pretty easy to find all the stuff. It wasn't like overly difficult. I'm pretty sure we got everything that we had to unlock. Oh man. Let me know what you guys thought of it. Uh, let me know if you even like watching these. Um, I know sometimes I probably just talked a little bit more in between. I try to I try to let the story go with whatever it's going for, and I try to make sure I, I would be a little bit more silent towards moments that felt like they were meant to be felt. You know, um, definitely definitely like the music for sure that they played. I felt certain moments were great. When she was screaming. At the end, I just didn't understand. And there was a moment where I was thinking, like, like I said, I thought we were trading the life of my father in that one for my wife. And then there was a moment where I thought, I don't know if I said it, but there was just a moment where after all of it, I thought, like, 
she went through it all. How are we gonna... How are we supposed to ever get past this? I thought it was just gonna become a point where it was constantly she was gonna die on us. I didn't even think that we could sacrifice ourselves. <laughs> I was so adamant of wanting to have both of them together that I was like willing... I was contemplating the thought of having killed the father for the wife over killing myself, you know? That's how selfish I was. <laughs> Tell me that the little kid comes running in. That's what I want here. Yes! <laughs> and, he <coughs> <coughs> and he has the glasses. <coughs> and he still gives her the flowers. Don't hold back. You grab that flower. Grab it. Grab it. Never mind, just grab him. <laughs> that, that is precious. And I wonder if the flower color would have stayed the same. <laughs> the end. Ooh, that one got me. That one actually... <laughs> I called it that the little kid was coming. But the flower... Definitely. Definitely. And I grab a hug at the end. I thought for a second she might might unappreciate it because it brought bad, bad memories, but that should only bring good memory. <sighs> this this game. What's extras? The memories all unlocked. There's nothing left. Credits and back. All right, well uh, there it is, guys. Once again. Thanks for watching. I know this one went way longer than the others, um, but it was worth it. 100% I felt like it was worth it. So, catch you guys in the next one. Thanks again.